safe to catch even in uh, gold. Yep. And the bolt. Gorgeous. Yep, absolutely beautiful, isn't it? That's the shroud look. That's yeah. the air out, I think. Yeah. Nice little That's moderator. A beautiful moderator, isn't it? Now let's have a look underneath uh, Dave, I think on the bottom look we've got the anniversary uh, Oh yeah 40th it's, anniversary It's got a bit of mud on it look And it won't be long till you get yours will it? Hopefully, hopefully next month There's the humour It's been well worth waiting for Yeah okay it's gone on a bit but It's a longer you know, stock isn't it? Yeah, it's like Stutson Yeah, it feels good as well it Feels really well So that is the 40th anniversary uh, Day State genus. Yep. At the Day State factory. Okay, next up is the uh, the Red Wolf Midnight. Uh, same as the Red Wolf. The only difference is the stock is blue, hence the term Midnight. Lovely rifle. Now Dave's got the Red Wolf, and this one will be available soon. All electronic, aren't they, Dave? Oh, yeah, full electronic, mate, yeah. Comes standard with a shroud on it. And with the option of fitting a half-inch uh, moderator of your choice. Nice gun. And 10 shot. What's this one? Is it 2.2 or 177? This is a 2.2. No air in it. Okay. Thank you. Now this is uh, Dave. He's got the Day State Zar, and that's a collaboration with Atomen. Really nice field target, anti field target rifle. Well, I'll go there. And it's got lots of uh, adjustability. He's got the hamster on the front there, the grip, and then in, in the book plate and the cheat riser that's uh, wearing the uh, MTC optic scope and look at this one on here is this a safari? over in safari colours that is nice and what do you think to that one Dave? I love it it's lovely isn't it? I love the stock but the gun is a cracking gun as well yeah, beautiful. And it's got the Huma regulator on the right and the pressure for the bottom on the left. And these are 250 bar. 250. Yeah, safe up to 250. I think these come in t sub 12 foot pounds and high yeah. power as well, don't they? Yeah. Depending on the calibre. It's a beautiful stock, it's a beautiful gun and it shoots well, I've had one. Mm. So we were with Tony B last night at the Day State factory and what you got to show us then Tony? It's something new, it's a, um, a Wolverine R but in a forest laminate stock. So for 2019, for the 40th anniversary, we've changed around a few of the stock colours to give them a little bit special and we've used what was one of the most popular, probably the nicest mm. hunting colour on any laminate and put it on the Wolverine Eye. It was on the Pulsar, if you remember, yeah. but now it's on the, the Wolverine Eye. I think pretty nice. It was really nice, yeah. I think that'll be a, a good choice for most people, to be honest. So it's it's quite good for the hunter in there, isn't Absolutely. it? Absolutely. And is that available just in uh, sub 12 foot power? No, it's in all calibers and all powers. Uh, this is a sub foot, uh, 12 foot pound version with the carbon fiber bottle. It can also come in the aluminium bottle in 400 or 500 cc. So really this gun will go from 12 foot pounds but if you've got the license or you live abroad, then you can have it in 30 foot pounds, 40 foot pounds, and there's even a 100 foot pound 30 Crikey. caliber version. Now, when will these be available to buy, do you think? About another month, I would say. So probably beginning of May, maybe mid-May. So if somebody goes to the local dealer and puts an order in, hopefully they'll get it by the summer. Yeah, right. brilliant. Thanks, Tony. Cheers.